So I'm gonna talk a little bit about a traditional aftercare. People use this for years, but I'm gonna give you my tips that I think work the best for healing a tattoo. So the first video we talk about the Tegaderm, or there's brands like Second Skin Sanidorm and all the different brands. But we're gonna talk about if your tattoo artist covered the tattoo with a clear plastic like this, or they covered a tattoo with a dry lock. So sometimes tattoo artists like to put a, put a dry lock and they like to tape it, or sometimes they put a dry lock, they wrap it in, with plastic on top of it, or sometimes it's just regular plastic. So if your tattoo artist put this on you, you keep it for two to three hours, or if you're driving or flying back home, just try to keep it until you get home. You have to take this off once you get home, wash your hands first uh, in a sink. Just make sure the area is sanitary. Wash your hands with the soap and water first, and then you wash the tattoo really well with a bar soap or any liquid antibacterial soap. Just make sure when you're washing your tattoo, you don't dab it like this. You have to really wash it. Once the plastic is put on, your tattoo produces plasma that helps your skin to heal. It's almost like white cells that are fighting bacteria or trying to build a new layer on top. So you have to wash all that slimy stuff off. So you wash a tattoo really well for a couple of minutes with a room temperature water, dry it with a regular towel. Why? Uh, we try to wash it because if top layer of a tattoo dries, it's gonna form a scab. And once there is a scab, it's gonna take much longer to heal. It might build infection or bacteria between the scab and the skin. And then also it might take the top layer of the ink and tattoo when it heals is gonna look much lighter. So if you wash the layer that your body produces for the first two, three days, and then you moisturize your uh, fresh tattoo, your tattoo is gonna stay fresh and it's gonna heal. So that's the most important part of the regular aftercare, but I'm gonna tell you some tips of what not to do and what to do during the healing process. For many years of me tattooing in all different shops around the world in the United States, we've been told that Aquaphor is the best aftercare for your fresh tattoo. About six, seven years ago, I discovered that it's false. The Aquaphor or A&D is a petroleum-based cream that is very greasy and if you put a thick layer on your fresh tattoo, it doesn't help your healing process. So it stays on top of your skin and it doesn't let your skin to breathe. And a lot of people, they think as more cream you put on a fresh tattoo, it's gonna be better for the healing process. It's very false. Um, I healed most of my tattoos with the dry heal and they healed the best uh, versus the tattoos that I healed on myself putting the cream on and I've been heavily tattooed for the past 18 years and some tattoos that I have that I healed mostly just washing it and not putting anything on healed much nicer and brighter than tattoos I've been put the cream on. I tell my clients do not use this in any occasion. It is better not to put anything on a tattoo than to put any aquaphor or any petroleum based creams. The best thing for your tattoo is to keep it clean and put a lotion, uh, something like Aveeno or Lubriderm, as a very, very thin layer. There is also a lot of aftercare products that are super amazing. They are natural, they don't have any artificial stuff in them, and it's mostly just um, lavender or aloe and stuff that helps to moisturize the skin, like coconut oil or any tea tree oil. If you're using any products like that, do not apply thick layer on top of your skin, just try to put as little as possible. Let your skin breathe and let it uh, heal itself. There are a lot of products nowadays that you can buy even at Walgreens or uh, Walmart. Uh, some of them uh, are tattoo related. There are products like H2 Ocean that are very good for uh, tattoo healing process. I personally like Ohana Butter. I've been friends with the owner for many years and we use their products at a shop. We use their products during tattooing process. Um, so we usually give the clients that didn't get Tegaderm on their skin, uh, we give them this little thing that you just basically take a little bit with your finger, it melts, it's like a butter, and then you apply a very thin layer on top of your skin, and people do it for about five, six days until the tattoo is completely healed. But do not take a lot and do not put any greasy layers, it should be almost like when the skin needs it, you'll feel like it feels dry or it just pulls like your skin together. 
So you can just take a little bit with your clean hand, uh, rub it between the fingers until it melts and just apply almost like a moisturizer. Basically your tattoo should heal like a sunburn and the top layer of the skin should be peeling for three, four days after your tattoo is done. And that's the normal process. If there are any layers of plasma that is dried on top of your fresh tattoo, don't scratch it and try not to pick it because it might heal patchy after a tattoo is done peeling. In my many years of being tattoo artist, this tip should give you the best possible results of healing your fresh tattoo.